led by the Spirit into the wilderness to be tempted by the devil. After 40 days and 40 nights, he was hungry. If you were in the place of Jesus, having no food nor water for 40 days and 40 nights, what would you do first? Maybe some of you will find water to drink and some will find food to eat. But what happened? The tempter came to him and said, If you are the Son of God, tell the stones to become bread. But Jesus did not do that, for he said, It is written, Man shall not live on the bread alone. But every word that comes from the mouth of God. Jesus knew that the devil was trying to make him look silly. Yet the devil did not stop disturbing himself. The devil took him to the holy city and had him stand on the highest point of the temple, saying, If you are the Son of God, throw yourself down, for it is fit. He will command his angels concerning you, and they will lift you up on your hands, so that you will not strike your foot against the stone. But Jesus did not obey the devil, but he answered him. It is also written, Do not put the Lord your God next. The devil did not give up his lead. He did not stop trying to make Jesus look silly. He showed Jesus all the things around them. The devil took him to a very high mountain and said, If you will bow down and worship me, all these things I will give you. And Jesus did not like what the devil said and answered him, Away from me, Satan! For it is written, Worship the Lord your God and serve Him only. Then Satan the devil left him and he went away right away. He became afraid of Jesus because of the power of God's word that Jesus had told him. Jesus was able to stand against Satan using the word of God and not using his arms and feet to make the devil go away. Truly, the Word of God has power to defend you against the enemy. Therefore, let us always meditate the Word of God. So that's all for today's Bible lesson. The enemy or the devil brings a lot of troubles in your life. So use God's Word to defeat him. I hope everyone has learned for today's lesson. As we end our kids' TV today, like and share our video. And now, let us close in a prayer. I ask every one of you to bow down their heads and close their eyes. Dear God, thank you for the story of Jesus. Thank you for showing me how to defeat the enemy. Please help me and guide me against the enemy. I will always fall upon your name. Whenever I am afraid. All we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for watching kids. Bye!